they tell us in this question that we have a geometric sequence. A property of our geometric sequences is that term 2 divided by term 1 will always be the same as term 3 divided by term 2. Want some proof? Well, imagine we had a sequence that goes 4, 8, and 16. That's a geometric sequence. If I take term 2 divided by term 1, that gives me 8 over 4, which is 2. If I say two, th term 3 divided by term 2, that will be 16 divided by 8, which is 2. So the ratio remains constant. So when they give you a question like this, all you do is you write this out, and then you just fill everything in. So it's x plus 1 over 4x minus 2 equals to x minus 3 over x plus 1. Do cross multiplication next. So you end up with x plus 1 times by x plus 1 equals to x minus 3 multiplied by 4x minus 2. You see, so what I did there is I just took these numbers across. We're then going to multiply out. I'm going to do it fairly quickly because you guys do know how to do this. I'm then going to take everything to one side. And then I would use the quadratic formula. And so we would find that x is 5 or x is a third.